Name change, Cheyenne Vlismus, no longer Cheyenne Bay. Cheyenne Vlismus is fighting Mallory Martin. And, you know, listen, man, I was, I've been doing a lot of thinking on this. People are making a really big deal out of the separation, I believe, of the name, you know, for Vlismus. That's her, but that's her maiden name. That's her original name. AJ, if you were making your big shot right now into the UFC or the NFL or NBA, whatever, right, and you got married and for whatever reason you took your spouse's name, would you ever feel truly fulfilled in the sense where your identity is being showcased and shined, right? Because it's not your name. Bayes is not her last name. That is the name she inherited via marriage. So getting the Vlismas back, uh, she had even commented on Instagram saying it's going to be like a dream hearing my actual name called, for real. So people are making a big deal out of this. That's none of our business, personally. But just tell me what you think about that. Do you think the identity, the whole true childhood dream is now being fulfilled? Because you actually get your name called. I, li I like that. You know, there's there's two ways to think about it. I know a lot of the time, sometimes, you know, celebrities, especially when you're in this kind of limelight that the UFC is in, they'll change their name just to not have that pressure on their family. You know, mm -hmm. a lot of the time the family gets, starts getting hit up for money and whatnot. Yeah. Honestly, I, I like that, that she went back to her roots. You know, it's, it's, it's that pride thing. I got mm -hmm. a lot of family pride, you know, yeah. even though I'm a little bit of a nomad traveling around, La Raza is still La Raza. La so, Raza. you know, you got to be proud of the family, man. I, I like that she's going back, even if there is some, some, disagreements as far mm -hmm. as the last name switch i like it a lot what about you yeah yeah no i mean listen i'm indifferent about it honestly i think it's cool because she gets to do what she wants to do i just think people have been making a big deal out of it because guess what you made your usc debut with your husband or you know husband at the time and you kind of made your fame connected to this other man and this other name you're literally you came into the ufc as bay so people are always going to remember you as that so now it's going to be just a little bit of time to you know she just needs to get a couple big wins and then that blissmas name will actually stick but it's kind of similar caitlin chukagian um her name is no longer chukagian but she keeps chukagian on her fight shorts um you know just because that's how it goes like nina nunez before she was nina nunez she kept answer off for a little bit so you know neither here nor there the point is she's fighting mallory martin right and mallory martin if you remember hashtag no one can save you that's her whole thing right well no one saved her in her last fight, man. Rough, very rough. And I remember watching the game plan, and she just rushed into it. She was fighting some grappler, and Mallory Martin just rushed in and got taken down and finished, like, immediately. And I was like, God damn, this is terrible. Because I'm a big fan of Martin, dude. She's very skilled. And I think that this is going to be uh, one of those bounce-back fights for her where she needs the win. Uh, Cheyenne Vlismas, she needs a win here, too, to capitalize and build on her momentum. Minus 190 is Vlismas with a plus, one, uh, plus 150, excuse me, comeback for Mallory Martin. Over under two and a half rounds. Who do you like in this fight, AJ? Uh, yeah, I think this is actually a bounce back fight for both of them. Mm -hmm. both, both fighters really need a win going forward. Uh, I'm going with the name change, man. I'm going Vismus on this one. Uh, Vlismus, Vlismus, Vlismus. Yeah, Vlismus. Yeah. There we go. Uh, however you say it. I'm going with Cheyenne on this yeah. one. I think she, it's honestly a very close fight, though. Yeah. What about you? I like Martin in this fight, AJ. Um, I just think that on the feet, I mean, the warrior princess, Cheyenne Vlismus, she's going to have all the success on the feet. When it comes to the grappling, things are going to get interesting. And I think Martin is going to learn from her mistakes that she made in her last fight. This is do or die for her. And I think in those situations, man, we see what you're made of. I think she's a very talented prospect. And, uh, you know, listen. There's, you have to be motivated, especially when there's a hype train in front of you. And right now, Cheyenne has a lot of hype behind her. So we'll see what happens. But uh, yeah, I'm, go I'm leaning Mallory Martin on that one, plus money. But we'll see what happens, man. You never know. Like we just said earlier, this is the fight game.